In NBA 2K17, I had a build called the Athletic Finisher. Now this Athletic Finisher was one of my favorite builds on the game. It was an underrated build. Now this build would dunk on anyone. If you in the paint, you're getting boomed on. That's the type of build it was, man. That's the type of build it was. So I loved it so much, I made it in 2K18. Now this one was called a Playmaking Athletic Finisher. Look at that record, bro. I was always a sweat, man. Now look at this one this one we was going crazy too and i had him looking like lebron over there going crazy dunking on everybody dunking over everybody now this build was lit and also a very underrated build that was a lot of fun as well i was dunking and shooting in 2k19 i made another athletic finisher now this was the last athletic finisher i made in the 2k series beyond today this athletic finisher was fun too it was also very underrated because not a lot of people had it either. So guess what we doing today? In NBA 2K22, we about to do it again. We about to have the athletic finisher here. All right, so I'm going to show you all exactly how to make it, bro. So first of all, the athletic finisher is going to be at a guard position, all right? It's going to be 6'7", so it's still big like the other ones, but it's going to be a shooting guard. Now, shout out to the dude. One of my subs who gave me this bill, man, he DM'd me this whole bill. He like, yo, make a vid about this, man. And I was like, what the world? I ain't never seen this build on this game. Now, y'all may have seen other people post it. I don't know. You know what I'm saying? I'm just going off of what the sub hit me up with. I thought it was an interesting build to share with y'all. You know what I'm saying? Y'all like when I throw y'all some rare builds here and there. So I thought I'd share this with y'all. So this is how you make it, all right? You want to do close shot at 84. Driving layup 91, driving dunk 91. So it's going to give you a 17 finishing build. All right. And remember, with this, you're going to end up getting elite contact dunks. The difference making a lot of builds. Now, with the shooting, the shooting looking kind of sus, my boy. I ain't going to lie. We athletic finish, we're not athletic shooting. All right. So we're going to get six of them things. And you're going to have to live with six, bro. I ain't going to lie. You're going to have to live with six. So we go ahead and go with pass accuracy. We max the ball control, and we're going to do a little bit till we get like 14. I think I want 14, and that's what I chose to go with, 14 playmaking, which is enough to ISO. It's enough to dribble around and do what you got to do. It ain't too crazy, but it's just enough. Now, the defense, even though he's a split, we're not going to get too crazy on the defense either because the way you have to do this in order to get the name, it kind of cruises it a little bit, but see, I'm a legend, so I can add to my defense. So if any of y'all legends, y'all can add to y'all defense and make it more. Or you can just roll with it like this. I mean, 11 defense is still good, and you got 17. You spread out pretty well, bro. You still spread out relatively well. And I was messing around with it, trying to see if I could find an even better component than I have now. But this is what I chose to stick with. So we're going to go with Burley, Slide, or Build. I chose Build. I went 6'7". Now, the weight, I was messing around with the weight. You have to have a 216 and drop the wingspan two times. And then you're going to go ahead and pick slash and take. Like, why would you not pick slash and take on an athletic finisher? And you're going to get a Ray Allen athletic finisher, which how the hell is this Ray Allen, bro? Somebody tell me how is it Ray Allen. There's no shooting, but we're Ray Allen. How is that possible? All right, question marks in the comment section. Ray Allen with a bunch of question marks. I don't know what's going on. So if you want to go ahead and make this rebirth build, you know what I'm saying? I'm going to show you how to make it right here. All right? So this is what we're going to do. All right, so when we doing rebirth, I don't want y'all to spend too much money. You know what I'm saying? So we're going to upgrade the, necess the necessary thing that we need to upgrade. Because, you know, I ain't, ain't got to do the whole 90. You'll be fine with how I'm doing it here. So I'm messing around with it right now. Let me see. I did perimeter defense. I moved up to lateral. And I did some steal. You got an 82 or so far. And then I'm like, mm, y'all don't really need rebound, but we're going to go ahead and give it to you anyway. So we got an 83 overall athletic finisher, man. It's pretty solid. You're looking at about 130K VC, man. 130K VC to upgrade this build. And I know a lot of y'all don't like that. But that's just the way the 2K goes, man. You're going to have to spend. Now, you see, I'm a legend, so I'm going to go ahead and put my points over on defense to give him more defensive badges to make him a more balanced build. So, the ses the starting seven I'm going to do, I'm going to always go with the limitless takeoff, posterizer, and slithery. 
the combo, man. You gotta have them. Them, them the most important bad. Nothing else truly matters. If we're gonna do sniper silver, you know, I don't plan on taking any kind of shot with this dude. I ain't gonna lie, we not shoot nothing. We finna rim run and mash. Alright, so quick first step. Um, I know we need, I know we need unplug, but I did hyperdrive and unplug. Alright, so this is what we're gonna roll with. I think hyperdrive helps with you running forward, so that's why I chose hyperdrive. Now defense, I did one on hustler. You always need some kind of hustler, bro. Um, rim protector so you can like guard the paint pretty well. Chase down to help it out, and the rest on intimidator, bro. I'm hooking y'all up. This is what y'all want to do if you make this build right now. I'm giving y'all the whole setup, bro. I don't always do this. You know what I'm saying? I literally don't do this too often. So this style of video. So I'm getting y'all. I'm hooking y'all up if you want to make a new rebirth. You know, 2K free right now, so I'm helping y'all out. I know it's a lot of new 2K noobs, them saying he got it on Xbox. I'm hooking y'all up, you know what I'm saying? How many y'all Xbox? If you're on Xbox, he made this final video, type Xbox in the comments so I know who on Xbox. Now, here's the beauty of this build, bruh. That most builds don't get the experience, bruh. The elite contact dunk. I'm going to show y'all some elite contact dunk packages you're going to get that are pretty rare, bruh. Look at it. Little boy, get off the paint. These are all nasty that most people don't get, and because you're... You already have a 90 base when you're a 99 you getting all this man you're gonna get all these dunks bro that's the beauty of it you're gonna be an athletic finisher with every dunk package bro well all the guard ones so you're gonna have access to every single guard dunk package so that's gonna help you out man it's gonna put you in a position to have fun man you want to have fun when you play 2k so this is gonna help you have fun so i'm gonna go ahead and take it to the park and i'm gonna show you exactly how you're gonna be looking with your brand new athletic finisher, bruh. Your brand new athletic finisher. So when you go to the park, you're gonna look like this. This name, you, everybody, when they see this name, they're gonna be like, what in the world? Because nobody really got this, bro. I ain't never seen this in the park, ever. I don't think I ever seen this in the park. Only people that would probably have this is somebody like me, Uncle Demi, or another YouTuber, you know what I'm saying? That they're like build maniacs. They're the only type of people that's gonna do it, you know what I'm saying? A lot of y'all build words in the comment section. But not that many people really gonna be rolling around with an athletic finish. You're gonna be different and rare. Now, this build's gonna play very similar to my interior force, the skilled interior force video. If you haven't seen that video, I'm gonna show you a little clip of it. This build's gonna play just like this one. If you saw this gameplay, you saw how nasty this is. Now, because it's a half blue and half red, it's gonna play almost identical. This may have a little bit more finish, and this build is a little heavier. But overall, you're going to get the same output, the same level of dominance. Basically, you're going to be able to mash at will and have clans. You just will be lighter and faster than this build. This build was a little slow because it's max weight, but you're going to be a lighter weight. So you'll be able to do all of that and then some extra. So if you want to see this full video, click this link right there on the screen. Right? You see it right there. Go ahead and click the link and watch that full video. Hopefully, you enjoyed the video. Till next video. I see y'all then, man. Peace.